The federal government has been asked to strategize on effective ways of assisting widows to cushion the hardship they face by empowering them adequately to take care of their children. This was the appeal in Lagos today as the Lawrence Grace Foundation offered diverse support to widows of the Makoko area of Lagos in the spirit of the current festive season. Senior correspondent Jacqueline Ogo has details and will return with business news. It is not easy to be widows because as I am, I'm 38 years with four children and it's not easy for me to take care of the four children. She is one of the 200 widows desperate to get some relief from the current harsh dictates of the country's economy. In the rural area of Makoko, an axis of Lagos State, who came to benefit from the largesse provided by a non-government organization, the Lawrence Grace Foundation. Health is paramount to us. We ensure that we give them good quality health services, any community we go to. So a lot of them have seen the doctors and the nurses already, and the pharmacists have dispensed drugs to them already today. Medical checks for hypertension, diabetes, malaria drugs, blood tonics and vitamins were made available to the widows free of charge. The founder explained why. We know government cannot do everything, but we need government intervention to cater for those women. A lot of them don't even have food to eat, but less of taking care of their children. And that's why we've taken it upon ourselves. We pay their children's school fees in some cases, while we take care of the women as well. The widows who said they never knew one intervention would come like this spoke about how timely it is. I have uh, BP. I have diabetes. I really appreciate this intervention today because uh, they give us medicine, they give us a lot of things. They advise us on how to keep ourselves away from diabetes and uh, BAP. They are doing great for us with all these medicals they are giving us. That's one of the, that's one of the things I want the government to do for us. We don't have the capital of taking most of these challenges. The widows were taught how to make local drinks like the popular Zobo, Tiger Nut Drink and dishwashing soaps to boost their income. They went away with gift packs appealing to the government not to forget them and their children like some of their in-laws have done. Jacqueline Ogo, TVC News, Lagos.